What the hell? Is that Homer? Hello guys, welcome to the new video. We have 20 awesome tweaks to show you here. Okay, this is my buddy who's watching out for me. Anyway, so let's begin. I have to say that I'm pretty amazed by the fact that we have the old school OG tweak here today, which is enabled and supporting iOS 13. This is battle tweak, and I, I'm sure you know about this tweak. It does the same thing as Cylinder does, which makes this kind nice looking animations on your iPhone. However, the tweak is not free and you can select from the same library, same set of movements across your, across your device. So this is Barrel, awesome OG tweak. The next one is Dock 6. Dock 6 brings the, again, old style look to your dock. As you can see, it's not rounded anymore. It's just stuck down and it covers the whole area for the dock. This is from the iOS 6, which is pretty cool. Now the next tweak is called Dope Combos. This tweak makes tons of customizations for your messages. However, not big fan of this of this tweak. Uh, it has a lot of thing to to uh, add. As you can see, the colors of the text are different. Once you go inside, you can set a different background. You can have different uh, colors for your bubbles. You can set exact time of your messages. So there are a lot of customizations, but that's really the problem. It's too many things. So I have to go inside and, and check everything. Some things are not even there. But anyway, pretty cool tweak for those who, who like messing with, uh, with messages. This is Dope Convos. It's not free tweak. The next one is 5% alert. So you can set customized uh, minutes be, uh, when you want your battery to give you a notification. So I set for seven percent, for example, which is not really, which is not really that that common. So this is five percent alert. Very simple one. The following one is called go away sep go away separators. There is no settings for the tweak, but you can get the picture. There are no separators in the menus. As you can see, nothing is. There are no those. Uh, there are no horizontal lines which separate different different uh, menu items. So it really cleans up your your settings or any other you know menu like this. Okay, the next one is Homer Run, and you can see it shows CPU usage or the internet speed usage. I I guess, and you can select from. Three images here, you can have Homer, Pikachu, or Cat. Let's select Pikachu, but anyway, I need to respring so later. And you can see that depending on your, uh, how much you torture your phone, Homer goes crazy. So the faster the internet speed or the CPU speed, it goes, it goes crazy. I don't know what am I doing currently, but apparently I'm driving him nuts. The next one is super cool, it's called I auto reply. So again, this is for messages, the tweak for messages, it's not a free tweak. And big shout out to the developer who was kind enough to share this with me. So you can set up a general message for people, if you want, for all your contacts to send a reply after a certain amount of time, if you don't respond yourself. So for example, also if somebody, you can set up the word recognition so when somebody sends the words hello this is what i did uh i can reply after 10 minutes hey what's up you see so i don't have to think about it i can automate it so you can do it for all contacts or you can select certain contacts which you want to send automatic reply to you can also blacklist some contacts etc etc so this is up to you it's pretty cool tweak for those of you who are not responsive to your messages very quickly and you don't want to be rude so you can just send some general note hello how are you so by now i guess you've noticed that all of my uh text in my settings is small letters so i don't have capital letters anywhere as you can see which is thanks to the tweak called lower 
So lower makes all the text throughout your document, throughout your iPhone, lower in the emails, in the messages, in the uh, Facebook, Twitter, all those those apps. Connected uh, connected uh, tweak is called a low power, a low lowercase app names. So as you can see, also my app names on my lock on my home screen are all lowercase letters. I think it look, looks pretty neat and uh, it looks different. You, you, you can really notice you can really notice the difference. So this is lower and a lowercase app names. Now music album scroll is a super super neat tweak which uh, instead of scrolling through your recently added songs and albums in music app uh, in Apple music app, Vertically, you can scroll them horizontally. So how it looks like, and plus you can add this rounded uh, screen, um, play music art. So you see, you scroll them like this instead of traditionally up and down. So these, this is thanks to music album scroll. So I think it's really nice and really cool looking interface. The next is Nita. Nita is the tweak which enables this uh, weather information on the in the left corner instead of your um, text for your uh, telecom operator. As you can see, I see the uh, current temperature. You can show the emoji, you can show the temperature, you can hide the breadcrumbs, hide cellular sing signal, etc. And you can select when to when to invoke it. I uh, selected when I uh, open my control center. So if you prefer this kind of things, just to see what is the current temperature, I suggest Nita. Now the next one is pretty straightforward, and it again cleans your cleans your clutter on your phone. As you can see, when I scroll down, something is missing, right? So there is no scroll bar on the side showing where you at during your scrolling. So if you are for this kind of look or if you don't need it, you're not noticing this, I suggest this nice free tweak called no scrolling. This is the latest tweak. Big shout out to the developer again. Very cool guys, these developers. Uh, so pin heads for WhatsApp. As you all know, iOS 14 brings those pin heads to be honest, not big fan, to be honest, it's not very practical for me. But anyway, for those of you who like it, now you can have the pin heads on your in your WhatsApp. So WhatsApp gives you the option that you do this and you can also unpin or open the uh, messages. You can also scroll like this. You can pin it or do whatever you like. And you can have more of these, right? So they are... Uh, put up there and for easier access. Again, I'm saying not big fan of these pin heads, really kind of, they, they look annoying for me. But anyway, for those of you who like it, I think the developer did a really good job on it. And now you can have pin heads in your WhatsApp. Now, this is a really cool tweak, very useful tweak for us who use Safari a lot. So if you, when you open a page, there is this, share button right so if you want to share the page fine you do so but if you hold it you get the search but search uh, option right there so for easier access this is the tweak called safari find so you can just uh, type whatever you want and you can get you know uh, you can find anything on that web page so this is safari find and it gets invoked simply by just you know uh, sorry holding this share button here. Very cool tweak. So the next tweak is also for those of you privacy freaks who want to, if you're giving your phone to someone, maybe you want to freeze it or you want to make a joke out of it. I don't know. So this is the tweak screen freeze. So the screen freeze tweak depends on the activator. Activator is a useful tweak, free tweak from Ryan Petrich, and it gives you all sorts of customizations. So for example, uh, when I go, I want to set it up that on my home screen, when I, um, let's say, I wanna drag my fingers from bottom to top, not this from bottom to top, and I want to set it up to have my screen freeze, yes. To get this option toggle screen freeze so i go back and i do this so when i do this as you can see my screen is locked nobody can do anything 
about it. Unless I do this, and then it asks for the face ID and it gives you the option to unfreeze it. So just I need to do this, sorry, and the screen is locked. Nobody can touch it. So it's pretty neat tweak and I highly recommend it. Signal, so sorry, screen freeze. Now the next one is also a big shout out to the developer, really cool guy, another cool guy. I received this Signal Reborn. So the tweak gives you the option to see where are the nearest towers for your, you know, internet connection or your cellular connection. As you, you can see in each moment where you are currently, you know, um, connected to. So if you are like a sucker for these things, you can really make good use of the Signal Reborn tweak. Now the following one, hi. The following one is called Skinny Menu. So I don't know if you remember when you do the selection button and then you have this menu. So Skinny Menu removes the Share option and uh, what was the other? Yes, Lookup option. So if you've never used this, uh, options in the copy paste menu so skinny menu is the right tweak to go to the next one is called square 13 square 13 makes your applications look like this so they are all they are all uh, of squared you know has squared shape even uh, when you go into the menu as you can see when you open it like this it's squared so when you open applications, you can see that it's coming up to you in a squared shape. So it's, uh, I have to admit it, I like the way it looks. Now this one I cannot really show you guys, but uh, it's called support the unsupported revived. So there was an old tweak which remove that annoying message when you have unsupported accessory or some charging cable or something. And this one is uh, removing this obstacle when you plug in something which is not officially supported by Apple. However, I have to warn you, don't play with this. Uh, don't charge your expensive phone with, you, with some uh, you know, cheap cable. It can, it can have uh, hazard, hazardous effects. Now this is a strange tweak's name, tap tap tip tap time, tap tap tip tap time, try saying this 10 times in a row. So tap tap tip tap time uh, gives you the option that when you tap here, you can change it to, well actually now we are changing to uh, the weather, but it should change to the date. It's changing to the weather because I have Nita installed. So it's uh, probably clashing, clashing with it. But as I said, it should change to the, uh, whether let me just disable Nita tweak. So going back to tap tap tip tap time, which is a free tweak, as you can see, I have time here and I can tap on it and I can see the date, 20th of July. I can just tap and go back. So this is this is it. Now, this is this has been fun. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed my video and give it a thumbs up or you know recommend me to your friends. I would really appreciate it. Have a nice day.